Hi everyone, Brendan from c21teaching.com.au here. In today's video, we're going to take a bit of a walk through the Microsoft Office 365 portal again, and we're going to show you how to open and create a new document within the Office 365 suite. Obviously, you need to log in first. You will come to this screen here, the portal. You can see a row of icons. These will launch, if you click on them, they will launch each of the particular programs that you can see. In this video, we're going to focus on the main three, Word, PowerPoint, and Excel, because they're the three that people are most familiar with anyway, uh, and that are most commonly going to be used. There's two ways of opening a document. I can either scroll down and I will see recent documents. I can simply click on the document there or I can click on the application that the document I want is in. So for example, if it's a Word document, I can click on the Word document and I can see here recent documents are down the side. I can click on that and away we go. Now, additionally, if we want to create a new document, I can. I need to go into the app for the document type that I want so I've gone into PowerPoint here to create a new one and you can see that there's a range of templates here uh, available I quite simply click on the one that I'm after that I, one that I want to use it will take its time it will load it up and you will now see for this one here PowerPoint which will be pretty much exactly what you are used to using in the regular desktop version um, the functionality is pretty much the same the addition of course of the share button up here in the top right hand corner to allow you to collaborate with others and to share the PowerPoint with other people immediately without having to upload it and or email it to other people. Let's take a look at the other way of creating a new document. Coming back to our portal, if we scroll down we can see here there's an option for new. If I click on new a dialog box pops up. It gives me an option to create a new Word document a PowerPoint presentation or an Excel workbook. So if I go ahead and I click on Excel workbook, it will bring me to this screen anyway. It will give me either a blank workbook uh, as well as a list of potential templates depending on what I'm doing. And I can simply select the one that I'm after. It will go ahead, load it up, and there we go, ready to go again with the functionality, with the appearance of pretty much what you're used to in the desktop version. You've just got the addition up here in the top right hand corner of the share button. So that's how you can open an existing document or create a new one. Let's have a look at how we can upload a document. So to upload a document into Office 365, the cloud version, you can come down here in the bottom left hand corner, there is a dialog box here that says open from OneDrive for business. So if you already have a document in your OneDrive, you can click on that to open from OneDrive, or you can also check this box to allow you to load in from a Dropbox account. Uh, if you don't have something in a OneDrive account already, you do need to go to OneDrive, upload it into the OneDrive and open it from there to bring in a, a new document. So that's all we're going to have, the time, have time for in this video. For more videos like this, check out c21teaching.com.au and we'll see you next time. Thanks very much.